Hello friends, welcome to Unreal Engine Blueprints video tutorials series. In the previous video tutorials, we understood what is Blueprint in Unreal Engine, types of Blueprints available in Unreal Engine, the difference between Level Blueprint and Blueprint class. In this video, I would like to discuss Nodes and Pins. Nodes and Pins. What are Nodes? Nodes are building blocks of a Blueprint. Of course, Blueprints are made of Nodes guys. Nodes are displayed in rectangular or capsule shape. Nodes are displayed in rectangular shape. Nodes are displayed in rectangular shape or capsule shape guys. There are wide variety of nodes available in blueprints. We have event node, function node, getter node, setter node, operator node, flow control node etc. In this example we have one event node and one function node. One event node and one function node guys. Event nodes are displayed in red color. Event nodes are displayed in red color and their title starts with event keyword. Event nodes title starts with event keyword. Function nodes are displayed in blue or green color. Function nodes are displayed in blue color or green color and their title starts with the F character guys and their title starts with the F character. So what are nodes? Nodes are building blocks of a blueprint. Let's understand pins guys. Nodes can have pins on either side. Pins on the left are called input pins and pins on the right called output pins. Pins on the left are called input pins and pins on the right are called output pins. Okay. Again pins are categorized into two types. Execution pins and data pins. White colored triangle shape pins are called execution pins. White colored Triangle shape pins are called execution pins. Other colored circle shape pins are called data pins. The other colored circle shape pins are called data pins. Execution pins are used to define flow of execution. Execution pins are used to define flow of execution. How our blueprint executes. That means when we click on the play button, begin play event is triggered and then anything is connected to it is executed. So here print string function will get executed. It displays hello world and empty white color triangle shape pin indicates end of flow of execution. It indicates end of flow of execution. I go to Unreal Engine. I go to blueprints drop down. I say open level blueprint. Here we have event begin play. I drag a wire from this execution pin and search for print string function print string so you can see there is a f character print string function and here i say h e l l o hello world 1 now i compile and save i go to level 1 and click on the play button you see hello world 1 is displayed so what happened when i clicked on the play button begin play event is triggered anything is connected to it is getting executed so print string function displays hello world 1 and this empty white color triangle shape indicates end of flow of execution if I again connect something to it, let's say I drag a wire again and say print string function. I search one more time print string function and here I say H E L L O hello world 2. So what happens? Of course, when I say compile, save and click on the play button, begin play event is triggered. The execution pins are executed. So from here to here it comes here, print string function displays hello world 1 and again there is a connection you can see. It goes to here and say print string function displays hello world 2 and there is a empty white color triangle shape which indicates end of flow of execution. So we see hello world 1 displays hello world 2 displayed guys. Compile save go to level 1 and play you see hello world 1 is displayed and then hello world 2 is displayed. So that is about flow of execution guys that is about flow of execution. So event nodes are automatically triggered once the event nodes are triggered anything is connected to them is executed step by step by following this white colored triangle shape pins guys understanding that is about execution pins okay data pins are used to take data as an input or return data as an output from the node okay data pins the other colored other colored circle shape pins are called data pins they are used to take data as an input or data as an output from the node guys We'll discuss them step by step. I hope you guys have clearly understood what are nodes, how do you identify nodes, what are pins, how do you identify pins, 
what are the different types of nodes we have what are the different types of pins we have what they indicate etc etc for this video tutorial this much is enough guys if you like this video hit the like button and share with your friends so that everyone will get benefited in the upcoming video tutorials we discuss more about blueprints for more benefits and be up to date do not forget to subscribe to our youtube channel keep learning keep designing keep sharing thank you guys thank you very much see you in the next tutorial